Funny that, right? Yeah, I know. I got stopped actually at the border. They checked my bags. I was like, what the fuck am I gonna bring in? Infrastructure? Like, I don't know. <laughs> It was weird, it was weird. They, they clocked me right away. They're like, mm, no, we can tell you're a faker. You're a faker, you don't even speak Spanish. Anywho, next comedian coming to the stage, Adam Summers, you ready? There he is. Okay, there he is. He couldn't be more, all right, there he is. Oh yeah, we are matching, aren't we? Yeah, okay. Sorry, this is like the part of the show where I like put my paper down and then I like introduce myself. But um, you know, okay, who here has seen me before? One, two, three, four, five. I have friends. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. Yeah. So, um, yeah, how are we doing tonight? Good. We we good? Not I got not bad. I got a couple claps. All right. Um, before I get started, I want to know where are all the women at? Yeah. Where are all the sexy women at? You don't count. You don't count. No. Okay, so uh, all the women in the audience, I haven't had sex in months, and my number is 419494. <laughs> okay. All right. Shut the fuck up. No. Okay, so, um,. Does anybody here think that the government is a piece of fucking shit? Yeah, no, they are. Like, when I heard about the Capitol riots and stuff like that, I thought, this is how the Hunger Games begins. We're not that far from it. We really are not that far from it. And it, it's kind of sad because, um... The government's a piece of shit. <laughs> and we're not that far from the Hunger Games. I just added that one in, so I'm gonna I'm gonna work on that one a bit more. <laughs> so bear with me. Anyway, so I went to a hotel once with my friends, and it was a two-bedroom hotel, and there were five of us. So um, I woke up the next day, and you know how when you wake up, you have to go to the who's talking during my set? Is it you guys back there? Is it you? <laughs> Relax, calm down. <laughs> okay, anyway. So, um, you know how like when you wake up, you gotta go to the bathroom and stuff? Okay, well one of my friends was taking a shower and I had to go to the bathroom, which if that's not already awkward enough, my other friend Brianna had to go into the bathroom and throw up. So, I'm there in the bathroom, my friend's taking a shower, Brianna, she's knocking on the door because she has to throw up. Talk about good timing, because if she would have came in and she would have thrown up on my dick, that is it. I would have cut that thing off and I would have sold it on eBay or the black market. Be like, I don't know what price you want for this, but you know, I'll give it away. For, I'm not giving it away for free. I'm not. I was thinking about it, but I'm not giving it away for free. German and Italians have great dicks, so I want to get a good price out of this thing if I'm cutting it off with uh, some vomit on it. I don't know. The vomit for free, you know, I don't know. So, who remembers going to middle school? One, two, three. Okay, I guess uh, I guess the other people don't remember or never went to middle school. I don't know. Okay. Well, anyway, um, I would hate to be a middle school principal because you know that they probably are hiding in there with some kind of drug problem. Like, they, they probably come off all calm and stuff, but behind closed doors, they're just like going to the secretary and be like, I need more. I need more. I'm having a bad day. It ain't working. It's not working. Not today. No. So it's like they kick their cocaine habit to move on to heroin. So I guess they're moving up. I don't know. When I was, um... <laughs> When I was a kid, uh, I had really bad ADD, so uh, I was on Adderall for a long time. And uh, uh, is anybody here, like, it's okay if you don't want to admit, but does anybody here have ADD? One, two, three. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah, all right. It's like, 
And it's interesting because um, for people who don't have ADD, it's, it's very interesting because one minute you're like this, and the next second you're like this, and then you're like that, and then you're like this, and that, and this, and that, and that, and you're like, hi mom, how are you? Where's the dog? I don't know, I let him out, but I don't know. So, <laughs> anyway, no, we're not always like that. We're not always like that. Well, anyway, um, so I was on Adderall for seven years and I never ate. But the interesting thing about being on Adderall when you're in school is that um, you are so hyper-focused on your work. And I knew that it was a problem because I'd be in, I don't know, science class or something like that, right? And uh, somebody would say my name to like ask me something simple as like, what's up, right? So they'd be doing my work and they'd, uh, they'd be like, Adam, and I'm like, what do you want? It was bad. <laughs> it was bad. So, um... Uh, usually I would kind of end on something silly, but uh, tonight I want to kind of uh, end on a more serious note. Uh, does anybody here, has anybody here ever watched Full House? <laughs> yeah, okay. The, uh, the guy who played Danny Tanner, Bob Saget, he recently passed away. So um, uh, I want to dedicate my set tonight in his honor. So um, thank you very much for coming out and uh, rest easy, Bob. Good night. Thank you.